Hey guys, Mustache Tom here, and welcome back to some more of the Rise of Ronin. The last time we got into the city section of the game, found some ninja cats too. Try to meet up with our pal here that we met. What up? So you made it, did you? It's been pretty lively here, ever since the black ships arrived and the port opened up. So, what brought you to Yokohama anyway? I wanted to see the black ships. I'm looking for someone I'd rather not say. Well, what do you know? I'm looking for someone too. And no regular person, let me tell you. I've come to pay showing Yoshida a visit. You must have heard the name. He's a great master whose gaze is fixed firmly on the future. He sees what we could be a century from now, and knows how to achieve it. The truth is, we studied under the same master. But now he has students of his own. You should meet him. He and his students should already be here in the city. They're an interesting bunch, believe me. <laughs> hey, did no one ever teach you to walk straight? Why, thank you, sir. That was very kind of you. Yeah. My name is Takaburayama. I'm a geisha in the pleasure district. It would be wonderful if the two of you could pay me a visit. Whoa! Oh, it would be our pleasure, truly. Uh, we were just discussing heading that way. Uh, oh. What marvelous timing. See you soon! Well, his priorities changed rather quickly. Great! Now, come along with me. This calls for a little celebration in the most fun part of town. Come on, the pleasure district's the best place for gossip. You'll hear all kinds of rumors. Oh, so that's why you're going? Mm -hmm. And besides, you saw that woman just now, right? There are sights to see in Yokohama before I start searching for Master Shoei. <laughs> and there's the real truth of the you're matter, right? supposed to be getting rid of the foreigners! Things are getting pretty tense around here. The Red Demon's been busy cracking down on the anti shogunate faction. What do people think Blind Panic's going to achieve? They should be spending their time thinking about how we can forge Japan's future. Found you, Sakamoto! You must be the samurai Taka spoke about. We've been expecting you. Ha <laughs> that's us. How could you tell? She said you are very dashing, and that you looked good in leather footwear. I knew it was you straight away. Damn! You're clearly very discerning. You'll make a fine geisha. <laughs> My name is Kitty. 
Kitty Saito. Allow me to welcome you to the Pleasure District. Oh, before I forget, while you are here, it is strictly forbidden to be uncouth or to unsheathe. Understood. Now, if you would kindly follow me. Fidel, sir. You must be sophisticated. When respecting the ladies. Here at last, my friend. My, my. What a place. Definitely a tale or two to be had here, I reckon. The district was only built after the black ships arrived. All kinds of clients come here. They're like, we need a place to get all those West guys to come so that we can get info out of them. And we heard the ladies know how to do that better than the men. Did you know that Kaka is our most accomplished geisha? It is very rare for her to grant anyone an audience so quickly. You two are very lucky indeed. Please wait in here. Kaka will join you in due course. Alrighty. Won't you have some more? Oh, thank you, my dear. <laughs> this is quite the place. Aren't you glad we came? He's baffled on her first. Isn't to lie there. What brought you to the city? Well, I can't be certain, but I have heard rumors of a certain samurai who came aboard the black ship. Working here, I hear all sorts of things, you know. Uh huh. But before I say more, I have a little favor to ask. Hey. I want you to take photographs of the Pleasure District with one of those fancy new cameras. They say a photograph shows things precisely as they are. Well, I want this place to be captured for posterity. Do that for me, and I will tell you about the samurai who came aboard the black ship. Yo, use photo mode alert, oh, nerd. I forgot to mention. To get a camera, you'll need to go to the photographic studio. I know you won't let me go. Alright, looks like we have our next mission.
Sleeping cats. As with other cats, you must get close to the calico cat to catch it. Be careful, though. Calico cats are highly vigilant. Any loud noise will scare them off for a period of time. Somewhere over here, then. I can hear it. I will pet that cat. Oh, oh, jeez, I'm sorry. Did we get out of your hair, miss? I will find all the ninja cats eventually, and I will pet them all. Thus is my Ronin way. I gotta do that now. Oh. Why not see what's up? Prompted to and everything. <coughs> Whoops. Pew! It's a little rundown, but pretty spacious inside. You can keep a change of clothes or anything you'd like here. I hope you'll find it useful. Check it out. Longhouse is now available. People 
with whom you have a bond with will visit you here to strengthen your bond with such individuals you want to talk with them, or try giving them gifts. The Longhouse is also a place where you can store items, add furniture, change your character's appearance, or change the appearance of your equipment. You know, it's not bad relaxing together like this. Let's have a talk. Have a, have a little spiel. Let's have a little chat. Interacting with people. There are several options available to you in interacting with people at your base. You can ask for their views on th times, learn about their personal history, and increase your intimacy by giving them gifts. Strengthening your bond will increase the topics of conversation available to you. I have something to ask. Oh? What's that? Well, that's the only thing I got. I wanted to do something about this country. There's only so much that can be done in Tulsa, you know. And I'm trying to do what's best for the whole of Japan. That might not mean what's best for Tulsa. If I hadn't left, it might have meant trouble for my family. I didn't really have a choice. Alright. Oops. I wanted to, and I'm trying, if I hadn't... So I got nothing. Uh, is that so? Cooperate with players on a mission, timeline, review the story, up to the present, X. The storage is where you can store or achieve items. pants the other day that were washed. The redesign function allows you to alter the way your equipment looks. So long as you have obtained a piece of equipment once, you can alter its appearance at any time. Even when it's not in your possession, the more equipment and redesign items you have, the more designs will be available to you. Changing the appearance will not affect the stats. Oh, nice. Look cool and be cool.
options I've collected already. You learned a new style. to move time forward. Oh, okay. Persuade interlocutor and bull. Don't rush. They 
idiota. Very well. Is that No problem. Do you have a blouse? What would it be? What would it be? Please come again. Issues. Boy, you! What are you doing here? You look shady to me. Out with it! Who are you? We're under strict orders from Lord E to arrest anyone suspicious. See ya. Thanks. That was a big help. No problem. Now give me a camera. I owe you. Those nitwits. They think cameras are some kind of weapon. Uh. I'd like to give you a demonstration. But I'm afraid my camera is broken. It means I can't add anything. Do. How is it, Igashichi? Got it working again? I'm afraid not. Without the schematic, I'm at the end of my rope. Ugh, curse those dumped thieves. Are you serious? Well, this isn't good. Looks like we got our new quest. Those thugs have no idea of the value of what they've stolen. But I can hardly just go and ask for them back. Are you a samurai? Uh, close enough. With your strength and my invention. Maybe, just maybe, could it work? Uh, I don't know, uh, uh, but it might. I can see it all in my head, the perfect plan. I need those schematics back, and if you help me, I'll give you a camera. Sound good? I'm in. A clear and rational response. You must have the inventors of spirit. Those thieves have a base in the Mitre Castle ruins, but we can't just stroll straight in. Head to the Temple Hall nearby. Oh dear! <laughs> I forgot to introduce myself. My name is Igashichi Izuka. Back home in Hitachi, I'm known as Igashichi the Tinkerer. Well, I shall see you there! Dear me, this seems he's fired up once again. Well, Please do what you can to help him. The side quest to the side quest. To the main quest. Sorry. Uh, 
as far. Player level six, level nine. Famed geisha of the Miyazaki Pleasure District in Yokohama, she earned her renown through her witty conversation and rather melancholic good looks, reputed to have performed as a geisha in Kyoto in the past. Feudal retainer of the Koshu clan and master of the Shoga Senjuku Academy, his dreams of abolishing the shogunate and the masses rising up under the banner of the imperial court to renown the country for form the country, excuse me. His pupils include Shinsaku Takasugi and Gensu Kusakai. While pursuing his studies in Edo, he met Ryuma Sakamoto and came to study under the same master. Inventor from the Hita Hitachi region, a disciple of Igasachi clan, or uh, Izaku, he's known as the Tinker. His name is inherited in recognition of his genius. He has built all manner of the me mechanical instruments, including handmade cameras, which are in no way inferior to their Western equivalents. Geisha of the Miyazaki Pleasure District in Ki Yokohama. She has a great reverence for the famed senior inter entertainer Taka Morayama, her former employment uh, as an intendant, as, as the U.S. consultant has put her on friendly terms with the Council General Townsend Harris. I wonder if I'm under level, can I still do it? even close to prepare to fight that guy. Luckily I didn't lose anything. I didn't say renown lost or whatever it's called. Let's see, that was level 12. 
That's level three. That's something more my life size. Let's go there instead. Sorry, lady. Thank <laughs> you. 
Come on. Ah. Ah. Oh. Nice and too early. You are pet. You couldn't escape my pet zone. Your horses have stats, y'all. You really know your horses. You got it. What do you need? See you later. What do you do? That is a very fine steed you have there. Great. Right. Would you like to try some horseback archery? Okay. Horseback archery is the ancient art of shooting arrows at a target while riding atop a horse. Although some might tell you it is incredibly old fashioned, I believe it to be an indispensable tool for refining one's etiquette. I do hope you will devote the time to mastering this important art. My name is Kiyokane Ogasawara. As the name would suggest, I instruct others in the Ogasawara style of archery. I believe the art of horseback archery is an excellent teacher of the true samurai spirit. Okay. As such, I make it a point to occasionally recruit new students from those I meet. Sure. Oops. Horseback art, also some. I do hope. Then let me be your guide. Please, this way. Compete for points by destroying roadside targets while with your bow while riding one of your horses. The faster you reach the goal, the more points you will earn. Scoring bullseyes will also increase your points earned at this, as the well, the activation of the d direct hit special skill. Press the button to. To pause the training session and start again from the beginning. Oh man, that's hard.
intermediate. Okay. Failed to rank score. Oh. I'm <laughs> pretty lame, I guess. Now, if you can learn to clear your mind of stray thoughts, your aim will surely improve. Can I get that skill from... Oh. Cool. Obtained a new bow. Yo, let's go. I'm glad to see you. Why not? That you would ask such a question is in itself a compliment. Mm. I imagine it is a result of my daily training. To master archery and to master one's manas are one and the same thing after all. But I know I still have room for improvement. As I improve my form with my bow, so shall I improve my form within society. Cool. Oh, weird. It doesn't fall under sub-weapons? Huh. So where's the bow, and how do I use it? Young master of the Ugasaro style of archery, he works tirelessly to promote the samurai spirit through traditional martial arts and his deeply rooted culture of respect bearing. Though celebrated as a boy wonder in certain circles, he's considered his skills to be the far from perfect. He unshakable his unshakable humility is apparent to all who meet him. Let's see. Bows can be used to stealthy attack enemies, land a headshot. Yeah, but when I I don't see the whole the bow in my equipment, and when I do it for that, it just picks the gun. I'm a little confused there. It's not, again, it's not under sub thing, weapon. It's not even under primary weapon. So, what up with that? Yeah, I equipped the gun when I... Weird. Why'd be like that?
please accept this. Whew. Don't pray.
Ow! sword dashes on me. What? Alrighty. Well, over on the YouTube side, if you end up enjoying that, then please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, make sure to check out those links in the description. One, we'll head over to my petition, how about smaller YouTubers? Second, to my PayPal, where you can help support me and my channel directly. And third, to my Discord server, so join, collab, shield, all that cool stuff. And until next time, everyone, bye bye. Uh...